Welcome. My name is Michael and on this channel I talk about life as a professional artist. Today is something that is really important and is something that I have personally struggled with and as someone who owns a publishing company and has worked as a talent scout for galleries, I see comes up in art a lot of times. And that's this idea that happiness is always over the hill. And so today we're really going to talk a little bit about mindset and what the mindset that you need to have to find long-term success as an artist and to find happiness in your career. Because I know a lot of people who become full-time artists and are even more miserable than when they weren't. Personally, I struggle because I always feel like where I'm at right now isn't good enough and I need to be going out and accomplishing something new. You know, I just had an exhibition, but now I need to exhibit somewhere more prestigious or exhibit 10 more other places. And I never take that time to reflect upon what it is that I've already done. And I always think like, oh, if I'm making X amount of money from my business or X amount of exhibitions or whatever, then I'll be happy, then I'll be where I want to be. But that's not true because as soon as I get that, I'll want more. And so today, the most important thing that I want to say is that happiness is here and now. And so if you go and you take that mindset and you say, I'm, I am happy here and now, or if you're not happy, what can I do right now to change it to make myself happy? And I think that that is really transformative, not just in terms of the opportunities that you will get as a result of that mindset, but also in the art that you make. Because if you're constantly unhappy with yourself and constantly trying to make art so that you feel validated by your own experiences, then, you know, by future experiences, then you're not going to make art that is the best that you could possibly make. I think that, you know, reflecting upon yourself and trying to cultivate a life of happiness is ultimately what you were trying to do when you became a professional artist. You know, if you, if you want to be a professional artist or a professional writer, you do it because you want to really pursue f your happiness full time. You want to pursue your passion. And I think treating your career and your business as that, as a pursuit of happiness, or as you know, an achievement of happiness that you get to live out every day is the ultimate mindset and will lead to more success than learning new techniques or taking an online course or anything like that. It's just learning to love yourself and appreciate what you have. Thank you so much. Be sure to subscribe. I have new videos coming out all the time. Have a wonderful day.